Hi, good evening. Yeah, sorry, I would love to know, please. Do you own or rent a home in Lagos? What's with the camera? Will you keep your mouth shut? No, please. <laughs> uh, sorry, it's content. Sorry. All right, cool. Yeah, I rent actually. You rent? Yeah. Oh, really? If you don't mind me asking, if you don't mind me asking, how much is your rent per year? Am I gonna? Do I have to say it on camera? Huh? Please, it's just content. I promise. <laughs> actually, I pay like two hundred million a month. Sorry, two hundred million naira a month. Yeah. Or a year. A month. A month. Come down. I'm down. Come 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 down. Make we check the house. 200 million naira a month house in Lagos. Well, now let God know what the guy they do. But let's check out the house. Okay. The house alone, eh? This house alone. 200 million naira. And Chama, you they proud of her. Now only God know what you they do, but even country no go ah two hundred million naira a month house in Lagos. Do you guys believe it? I don't believe I do, but two why two hundred million. Okay, let us uh, uh, convert it to dollar, you understand? Obviously, this man is not any in Naira, you understand? There is no job in Nigeria, even though you are a CEO that pays you 200 million Naira. No job. So, in order for you to have such money, you may have invented something, maybe online app, that is very very popular maybe you are a, uh, you are from a family generational wealth that you have one oil well or you have massive factory and you are collecting your shares from it or you invest massively on shares you you more definitely have a capital for you to invest massively uh, massively on shares but then again we want to know this guy's name you know, we want to know his origin to know where exactly where it comes from because if you are spending 200 million naira a month for rent in Nigeria, it's something none of us, eh, because we are poor over here, can ever understand. We are talking about 120,000 US dollars a month. That's what we are talking about. 120 thousand US dollars a month. Guy, where are you for they make the money from? Because someone who is hustling, an investor, a banker, or whatsoever you are, eh, will not spend such money because it's not investment driven. 200 million naira a month? Child man. I bet this guy I know they do illegal work because if he they do illegal work, he no go allow camera into his house or camera showing face. Come on, everybody don't learn from much puppy. Because certainly somebody will look for you in that security service, EFCC, ICPC, police. Somebody will definitely start looking into your matter to know where you are from. To ascertain if you actually spend such money or you just the lie. First, I don't believe I'm all. Maybe I would say that house rent for a month can be like 10 million, 20 million. Good and fine. But 200 million naira? Ah, it's a big lie. That entire house alone eh, is not worth 
close to 1 billion. It's not worth close to 1 billion. Or let me say like 600 million. So the person making the render house now will make his entire investment in six months. Chama, you did lie. 200 million naira, that lie. I swear, oh God, I don't believe up. 200 million naira rent for Lagos is a big lie. No be pent asshole. You are talking about grand asshole. It's a big, massive lie. Now, people like this say they make landlords, they increase money. People like this. Honestly speaking, be you a very illegitimate safer, you deserve to be arrested. You deserve to be called and questioned. And the owner of that property also deserves to be called and questioned because recently the Senate are trying as much as possible to pass a law to regulate rent in Nigeria. The House of Rep are, also, are, are, are currently on it to speak on the increase of rent in Nigeria. So people like you, eh, the landlord or you, self, eh, which I do not believe you, deserve to be called and arrested. That house no worth 600 million. That house, all that house do not, is not worth 600 million. Let us get that straight. Not worth 600 million. Man. See. Make you take your time on. Make you take your time on. Make you know they put some certain things. Stop destroying our youth with your with your with your lies and everything. You know. Just take your time, guy. Take your time. Take your time. Well, if you believe, let me know. And if you do not believe, of course, let me know as well. And that being said, let's talk about Victor Sime. Victor Sime no actually know where he stand. Yesterday, I reported, because of the news, that Victor Sime signed to Saudi Arabia club for the sum of 25, 30 million pounds per season. Hail at Hill Club in Saudi Arabia. And I outrightly criticized that move. I criticized that move a lot because Vito Simi is just 25 years old. Which you want to do for Saudi Arabia? Saudi Arabia is retirement money. You still have a lot of trophy to win. You still have a lot of medal to win to also prove yourself so that by the time they want to come for you to build, to sign you, you will no longer be billing 25 to 30 million pounds per season. You'll be asking for 100 million, 200 million pounds per season. Why you want to go wrong? Enter Saudi Arabia club. However, another news quickly came out to tell us that Peter Sime has reached an agreement with Chelsea. <laughs> we were all confused yesterday. <laughs> And Chelsea deal was loan based. And Vito Sime said he doesn't want any loan based deal with any club. He wants to be transferred there. But however, Vito Sime needs to sign his agent because his agent signed an extension contract with Napoli after his, his contract expired. So after this whole move, Vito Sime needs to sack that agent first. Now, we were told that Napoli has now retort their position that Vito Simi will stay in Napoli but will not be on the first team. He's going to be on the second team. Napoli is known for being notorious. It's a notorious club. Notorious club. Why are you now they waste our bright style life like that? Why are you now they use and they play ball? Bito Simi need to find his way out of that club immediately because after all Vito Simi did for that club, you see how they, they use and they play ball? After all Bito Simi did for that club. Huh. That's unfair, man. That's really, 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 really unfair. So Vito Simen need to leave that club ASAP. 
Napoli is not good and Napoli do not want his goodness. Napoli is, do not want anything good for Vito Sime. So try yesterday, Vito Sime was leaked to two clubs and later they said Napoli will make sure he's not leaving Napoli and he's going to remain at the second team. That means nobody see ball play again. They want to just useless him. But then again, Vito Sime is world class and uh, I think they are going to find a way to resolve everything. Him is just being quiet. But that move to Saudi Arabia is not a move I want for Victor Sime. You understand? And I don't know for Chelsea because Mikel is trying to get him to Chelsea because Mikel also wants a percentage of that money as well. <laughs> so, and the Drogba also is trying to also get into Chelsea because Drogba also wants some certain percentage as well from that deal. So we don't know how it's going to happen. And Victor Sime uh, agent already signed an extension deal with Napoli. So you see how they take rope this guy. They rope and finish. So let's see how he's going to manage out of the whole situation. Because he go add them Because the club too still want money. Well, let's see what 